Michael Williams was at this crisis center when, according to a search warrant, he said he was looking for someone to rape. This happened as a warrant was out for his arrest because he didn't register as a sex offender. A couple of weeks before Williams was accidentally released from jail, a concerning incident at a crisis center. A search warrant reveals he told police while at the center, he walked into the women's bathroom to find a woman to rape. Later, telling officers he watched a woman in a stall. After the woman left, he went back in and took all his clothes off and began to pleasure himself. Williams has a lengthy list of previous convictions dating back to 1990. That includes rape, stalking, indecent exposure, and assault throughout the years, and another rape in 2005. The Department of Corrections classifies him as a level three habitual sex offender, required to register for life. After what happened at the crisis center, Williams was arrested but spent less than two weeks in jail. Jail officials forced to release him, providing News 4 with a copy of this release order signed by a judge. This after the Oklahoma City Police Department failed to file the proper paperwork to raise his bond in a timely manner, and charges that would have kept him in jail after the initial 10-day holding period were never filed. Just hours after his release, that paperwork was filed and a judge raised Williams' bond from $5,000 to $50,000. Two days later, Williams was arrested again, this time for being a fugitive from justice. Angela Shen, Oklahoma's News 4.